Alrighty, boys. Uh, as mentioned last week, we will be continuing the Red Flag Redemption segment and not talking about red flags, but talking about icks. So thank you to everyone who has sent in uh, a vast majority, like people sent in heaps. Like, a lot of people heaps, are icked. Yeah, heaps and heaps <laughs> of icks. And I'm like, I just want to live my day on a daily basis without being, you know, thought of as gross by people. Bro, what is what is the difference between a red flag and an ick? I think ick's more like just something that grosses you out. Red flags is like, they qu- they're they just like a psycho, but mm. icks are more like trivial things that just yep. gross people out. Yep. Um, I have one as well, actually. I thought of one on the week. So I went on a date with a girl a couple of years ago. And uh, when we were eating fries, instead of just picking the fries like this, she used her whole <laughs> hand and like grabbed chips like in her palm, like a claw machine at the arcade. Yeah, it's like one of the skill tests. Yeah. <laughs> and like, what, what, were they falling out oh, as, they, oh, as they reached out? <laughs> no, they didn't fall out, but it was just weird. So she would grab it like like a claw and then eat out of her oh. palm. But like, if you're using, if you're not using, if you're using anything but your fingertips to eat food. Yeah. Ick. That's like, she's like squishing. She's yeah. Like, it's not nice to see. That is, yeah. That is a nick. That would turn me off seeing it. So along that line, we've got a couple of like running. Running seems to be a big theme. So <laughs> it's Harvester says that little run when they chase the beer pong ball. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, no, to be fair. Is that an ick? No, because when it goes off the table, it's like bouncing on the yeah, floor. Yeah. So you got, you're not yeah. running to one spot because you could bounce again. And you got to stop and start your It's like run. a little shuffle that you yeah. behind it. Yeah. And then sometimes you miss the ball. That's a big No, because the table tennis ball is actually quite hard to grab if you're like it's grabbing slippery. aggressively. Yeah. You have to like intentionally do it. So fair enough. It's Harvester. <laughs> <laughs> Manisha says the thought of someone running for the bus. And this is a common occurrence. I feel like this is a common ick, but I don't understand. I How else can't say I understand it either. Do I get to the bus yeah. if it's all Are you meant there? to miss the bus? Yeah. <laughs> I think, yeah, you're meant to like walk coolly and then just catch the next one, but- The well, idea of like to- actual running. No, no I not, think not the quick walking or like a, a you can casual never, jog. You can't look cool running for the bus. Like, you know, you're a- you're like your arms are flailing everywhere. You're trying to hail down the. I think yeah. that's a part yeah. of the fact you're trying to like you look desperate. Get attention. Yeah, <laughs> is that what it is? I think that's what it is. But I'm a serial runner for the bus. <laughs> yeah, same. I'm, I'm always late, late bro. Yeah, but it is a bit awkward to be fair. Like when you look at people, it's awkward when you run for the bus and you miss. Like he doesn't yeah, stop it for looks you. That then you look like a mug because you look at the people who are watching you run for <laughs> yeah. the bus and they're just driving off. <laughs> no, nah, 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 it's funny when you're you're on the bus, you're watching someone, they miss yeah, the bus, yeah. they get the whole. They throw their arms up there, <laughs> doing a whole shoot back, like trying to see them to the I driver, like what are you doing? Hit the bus as it drives off. Really? Yeah. That seems a bit aggressive. Aggressive, and definitely. Get there a few minutes earlier. That's also Nick when they attack a bus. <laughs> Inanimate objects. Uh, Joshua Elliott says, girls who trust crystals over Western ideas of medicine. <laughs> so we did we did talk about this last week. Ick or not a Nick? Uh, not just girls, just anyone who trusts crystals over Westernized medicine, for sure. That's a, that's a red flag to me, to be honest. Not even a nick. Mm. That's gone past the point of a I, I would entertain crystals for the shits and gigs. Yeah. But trusting it over Western medicine. <laughs> red flag, not an ick. Yeah, not an ick, not an ick. Uh, Sly, N-S-K-E-Y. How do I spell that? Or pronounce that? Niniski. Sly Niniski. Okay. He says, wearing when he wears no-show socks. Hey, what's wrong with no-show socks? I feel like Senny is a serial no-show sock. What's wrong with no-show socks? I think as you mature, your Your sock sock should mature. No, there's nothing wrong with no-show socks. Is this wearing, just wearing them, but you know, when you have shoes on, just seeing the fact they don't have socks, is that also an ick? Or just seeing the no-show socks? Because I can see just seeing the no-show sock on a foot looks kind of village, I'll admit. Because there's some, some people wear no-show socks but the no-show socks are too high. So they and just look like- Yeah, yeah that's an ick. When you can see socks, the no-show yeah. socks, yeah, that's an ick. What I, what I used to do like when I forgot, like when I didn't have no-show socks, but I had an outfit where I needed to wear no-show socks. Yeah. I would get normal socks and then just really roll them down like all the way to the bottom. What? So I feel I'd like that's a common them. thing. Yeah. And so eventually- Wasn't it bulky then? It is bulky. Yeah, but that's the price you pay for not having the socks. Aesthetics over Why don't comfort. you just don't wear Always. socks then? That's even, I reckon that's even more gross. That's gross, dude. No, really? Yeah. Fungus. Yeah. F- like, don't you wash your feet? No, but it's still like the dirt from the socks have accumulated into the shoe. So when you like start sweating and it's so much easier to sweat. It's easy to sweat, yeah. With yeah. no shoe, no socks. But I'd rather wear no socks than roll your proper socks. Nah, Disagree. I'd rather do that. Disagree. But no, I can see that no show socks are Nick. What about, what about like, is it because the outfit when people wear no show socks are gross? Because like no show socks usually are accompanied with like tight jeans. Yeah. Folded up. And skinny jeans, I feel like is a common ick these days. It's becoming a ick more and more these days. Mm. 
which is why I think as you mature, the socks get longer. The socks get longer. But in saying that, we have Vanessa who says, uh, men who cry in movies, but we'll, we'll move past that now. <laughs> and she also says, or well, guys that wear long socks, but the socks are a little bit too long. Too long? Yeah, I agree. That's a nick. What's too long? Thank you. What like, is too long? When it's halfway up your shin. I think that's too long. All right. Let's say we'll all agree that knee like length. Like just under the knee. Okay. I'm talking like we'll start up from there. the top yeah. down. Knee length. No, no. I'm are, yeah, are you a Japanese anime <laughs> model? No, <laughs> put them down. Are you, are you a footballer? No. Absolutely not. So yeah, anything down. like just below the knee is a no for me. Like that's too long, brother. Yeah, okay, are you a footballer? Like, <laughs> you're not a footballer, bro. Roll them down. All right, calf. Like let's say you flex your calf. I think that's okay. Are they, are they covering your calf? No, no, just under the calf is but where I would say is the- Let's say over the calf. Nah. Leg- legit halfway between your knee and your foot. Nah. If it's covering your calf, I think that's too far. What do we say? Yeah, no shirt. I mean, long socks are the sports bras of the calves. So you don't want to be covering the calves because they make them look exactly. thicker. It has to be just below the calves is what I'm thinking. But then there is a weird category of socks. All of us feeling <laughs> our feet feeling right our now. <laughs> but there is a weird category of socks where it's like, it's not high top. It's not no show. It's like- up just above your ankle. Cruise, no. Oh, crew cut. No, no, no. Crew, crew, <laughs> or half crew is the one that goes right below the calf. So there's a bit. There's like a common one. crew. Yeah. I forgot what they're called. Never wear them. They're, they're disgusting. Yuck. They're yuck. I have no idea what you're They sit just that. above the ankle. Yeah. They're not ankle socks. Oh yeah, I've seen that, I've seen that. Yeah, there's yeah. no outfit, there's yeah, no a, shoe. Isn't that like a kid's thing anyway? Don't they wear it for like when you just take time to go to school or something? I don't know, anyway. No, you still, those still ankle socks. Okay. Josh Newman. People that eat the black jelly beans. <laughs> big ick, dude. That's a big ick. Is what, the, what flavor is licorice? Licorice. Right? Yeah, nah, that's a yuck, ick. That's dude. Represents your character. It's <laughs> an ick. It's an it's, ick. <laughs> you should put them aside like a normal person. Christina says, guys who take selfies. Ick or no ick? What about girls who take selfies? Does the, it go both ways? I, I have no problem with girls taking selfies. Although I will say guys who take selfies, it's a bit self-indulged. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's, I don't know. It's just gross, dude. There's like guys nah, on- t- I, I don't know. I think it's, I don't really care. I am way. a serial gym selfie individual. Okay. In the mirror though. That's what I think is the difference. On the gym floor, not in the bar. I'm trying to defend myself here. No. Okay. So what I'm thinking of then, maybe I've misunderstood this is like no, front camera selfies. What's wrong with that? I think it's a bit yuck bit for of men to do it. What if I just send on Snapchat? Just with the yeah, filters and stuff. No, like but that. that's what shit's at gigs. That's, oh, okay, that's right. fine. You're putting- oh, But I've never seen anyone like post a front Yeah, because we're not friends with these icks. Okay, yeah. right. Yeah, that is an ick. That but is like, an ick. I agree. For example, none of us use Instagram, post Instagram a lot, right? Yeah. But there are guys out there that, I don't know, every week, two weeks, mm. selfie. That's a post for them. Yeah, that's Whereas a for us, that's, that's a, a Snapchat amongst the boys. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, Capturing yeah. with some outrageous nonsense, yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, but exactly. there are people that actually post even story it. Even yeah. if you saw one yeah. of your mates story just their face, <laughs> I'm having I'm words. I'm blocking them. I'm having yeah. words. Yeah, that's, so there that's you menacing. go. menacing. <laughs> yeah, I agree. You're saying gym selfies. Gym selfies, fine. Yeah. No yeah. problems okay, yeah. with like, if you're using the back <laughs> camera, yeah, yeah, no yeah, danger. Do whatever you want with that. That's front camera. Yeah, there's no rules. Yeah, there's rules yeah. associated with that. James Purcell, seeing gums when they smile. <laughs> <laughs> I did enjoy this one. That <laughs> I think this is a good example of an ick. It's just something so small and random. I feel so bad. You I can't change bad. You it. can't change that. You absolutely can't. Change. I think I. You can see my gums when I smile. Do it. Nah. Are you talking oh, about okay. the gums above the teeth uh, it's or the gums between above. the teeth? Above. It, How do you have you gums can't... between your teeth? No, see there's gum. Like, like the, at the slight, top of the teeth. I think, they mean, I think they mean like, above, like the yeah. above nah, the teeth. Nah, you can control that. Come off it. <laughs> Just, oh, really? Yeah. Smile. Control your smile, dude. It's not that hard. <laughs> Well, I agree actually, because you can just smile without teeth. People do that. I actually find that's a bit of an ick for me. That's it, yeah, yeah. People yeah, smile without teeth. Without teeth? Oh, yes. I'm a ser- I used to be a serial smile without <laughs> teeth. It's creepy. Like, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's like that. So <laughs> smiling in from cheek, smiling without teeth, ick. Yeah, yeah, very, very big much time, ick. Big time. Um, all right, Megan McGregor, using the two loops method to tie their shoes. <laughs> The bunny is. <laughs> the bunny is. Yeah, if you're over the age of 10 and you're still doing the two loops, you need to really, <coughs> what the fuck? There's two of us. <laughs> it's so easy, dude. Seriously. It's so much, you don't need good hand-eye coordination. Yeah. So my fine motor control, from like literally kindergarten, I have been getting in my report card, Rohit's fine motor control is terrible. 
<laughs> I don't have fine motor skills. And so the bunny ears are the way to go. No, the bunny ear method is so easy. That is such a nick. I'm Tell sorry. me you're looping around, you're shoving yeah, it in. It's so much quicker as well. I don't no, think it's it is. Not. I don't it think is it is. Quicker. It the bunny ears is two steps. <laughs> you do the knot, you do the ears. I agree with Megan. That is a big time red flag. I got roasted. When I, when I used to work at the uh, shoe shop, I got roasted constantly. Cause like part of my job was to bring shoes out and tie it for them. Yeah. And I could only use the bunny ears. And they just looked at me it's like, embarrassing. who are you? It's like, actually they you spat at you while you're down there tying their shoes. You may as well have. All right. We'll go back to Vanessa's men who cry in movies. <laughs> we need it. to revisit that one. <laughs> I think that needs to have a bit more of analysis associated with it. It's 2022. Yeah, it's fine to cry in a film. Ink. What's wrong with that? Does it matter what they cry at? Like if you're no, crying at Marley and me, Marley getting shot that or whatever, sad. or dying. Hey, spoilers. The if, dog you dies. Dies. if you haven't watched it now, <laughs> uh, you can fuck off. Yeah, that is a sad, genuinely sad moment. But know? what if they cry like, like that is a sad moment. So they're allowed to cry. That's fine, what what yeah. if they cry in like when Avengers, when hey, Iron, no, Iron no, Man you're dies. In, <laughs> no, I haven't territory. even seen it, but I've heard. Uh, you know, in the movies, I saw grown men cry when Iron Man died, you know, so I'll, I'll allow it as well. That seems like an ick to me. I feel like that's, I, that, know, I understand as well. It's I fine, understand. but I can understand that that's ick territory. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. a superhero, bro. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's not that uh, deep, bro. It's fictional. <laughs> so is the dog though. Yeah, that is true. Yeah, but that's a relatable experience. You're not telling me <laughs> the super, your local superhero dying. That's not a relatable experience. Tony Stark, people grew up with Tony Stark over 10 years. Yeah, that's so. I understand it, but I can see it from the other perspective. Yeah, I right? still yeah. don't understand it. I honestly don't understand yeah, it. You never watched the movies, mate. Men who cry in the notebook, for example, a rom romantic movie. Yeah, but the girls are probably crying as well, so it's fine. Cry together. No, but the girls are like, should be a man in this situation. Should they? I don't know. I feel like I like rom coms. I don't mind rom coms, but I don't Back cry Mountain. in rom coms. You don't? I don't think so. I just feel like, just feel good. I don't think I've ever that. cried in a movie. Ever? Ever. I don't think so. <laughs> I've teared up. Well, let's watch Let's watch a movie. I'll punch you both in the face. <laughs> <laughs> see what happens. <laughs> Especially the movie still playing. Yeah. I heard an ick the other day, impromptu ick. Mm. Men who have movies like The Notebook as their favorite movie. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, an, ick. Ick. that's an ick. That is, that's a, an ick. That is those guys are like that's white knight territory. Yeah, yeah, they're coming yeah, in. Nice and they're guys. Like, yeah, they're telling you, oh, I love the movie in The Notebook because I want to be relatable. Come there's off a, it. There's a word you use to describe people like that. <sighs> pick me's. Yeah, pick me. Pick me. That's a pick me's. You know? pick they're not like yeah, other guys. What's the What's the closest you've come to crying in a movie? When have you teared up? Like which movies have hmm. brought out that emotion within you? <laughs> Maybe the Avengers, to be honest. <laughs> <There's> no <laughs> way. Nah, I don't know. Like for example, right? Like uh, what's that Andrew Garfield movie where he's like a Jeff Sweet Preet? Hacksaw Ridge. Oh uh, yeah. Dude, yeah. that was hit. I was tearing up big time. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Just save one more, dude. He's good movie for those check it out. It's actually probably one of my favorite I think, movies. I think I'm quick to get emotionally invested in like Right. Tear up, but like cry, cry. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. think that's happened. Like I'll get emotional, but I won't cry. Like I won't sit there. The tears won't start <laughs> streaming down my Sand. face. I'm not a bitch. Like <laughs> <laughs> might have to believe that. I don't know. <laughs> this is cat as Nick Isaac says when they punch me in the stomach for little to no reason. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it when that happens. Yeah, yeah. That's a normal behavior, to be honest. We've got uh, guys that wear sandals, according to Sarah. Like, Perks are okay. What kind of sandals? Like flip flops? Are we talking about? Mm. Or mm. Um, sandals with like straps that go around straps around the like ankle. Oh and yeah, shit. yeah. Oh yeah, <laughs> like the like the Greek ancient Greek sandals. Yeah, like the the gladiator sandals. Yeah, or like Greek. like sliders, but there's a strap that you like in the back. I'm putting that as no, it. even the around. actual front. Wait, like you're talking about like a normal slider? Then. Yeah, but there's you got to clip it. That's oh, sandal territory no. for me. I, I think sandals is like- <laughs> Like like if it's Velcro. If it's pre-clipped and it's like- Yeah, yeah, like yeah. that's not the sandal. Uh, it's not a sandal, it's slipper maybe. Like you gotta actually, yeah, you gotta, yeah. if you <laughs> clamp it, that is it. <laughs> if this motion is done, <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a sandal. That's a nick, yeah. Really? Yeah. I think sandal, I'm growing into sandals. Sandals sense. is not a fashionable item. Yeah, I don't, I'm not a fan. They're functional though, they're beautiful. Flip flops is as casual I'll get, I can't. Either get a flip flop, a slider or commit yeah. to a shoe. Uh, you yeah, know what exactly. I will say though? Close toes, Or a croc, I'll give you a croc. Mm. Really? Yeah, somehow becoming- uh, Croc, I'm yeah. coming around. Sport mode, always. Dare I say crocs are just sandals with less steps. Like all that, because what I classify as sandals- are fa fashionable these days. No, but that doesn't make, yeah, that's, that's neither here nor there. They weren't five years ago. Like. What I think is a sandal is the back, the heel support. The heel support. There needs yeah, to be a yeah, heel yeah, strap. Yeah. And Crocs do have that. Yeah. But Crocs in league of its own. Why though? What, what they're changed? iconic. The holes, dude. You know, wear them in the shower. Oh, I've, never, in. I've never read a Crocs ever and I still don't. I really don't like slides. You wear, wear them slides. all the time. Yeah, that's because I can't be bothered <laughs> buying another pair. But like, I really rate your Haviana like thongs. Then buy some. <laughs> 
I don't know like what 20 bucks. No, 20 bucks. No, because what happens with the slide is that you just feet slide off. I don't know how to describe it. I think it's just- Okay, then strange. get thongs. My brother bought these Yeezy slides from AliExpress oh, or Alibaba. Yeah, and they are the worst. They are literally the worst thing I've ever seen. No, that's life. something in fashion these days, a cross between sneakers and slides. I've never seen that before. Oh, hey. Yeah, I've never seen that. No, because like what they're imitating is, so you know when you put on a shoe, but you don't fully put it on and your the back of your foot is yeah, on yeah, the yeah. heel, oh. not in. Yeah, yeah That's yeah. what they're trying to imitate. So the front is a shoe. That's so the back is open space, open plan. Open? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, no. That's in, that's in vogue. That is a no from me. Final one from Julie. Uh, she says, guys who like the fruity chewing gum instead of the mint gum. <laughs> Ick, nah, yeah, I'm back. That's an Ick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grow yeah. up. Peppermint or spearmint. That's it. <laughs> Nothing else. Really? Yeah. Yes, dude. It's chewing gum. But they're all it, white. It's just white. You don't even know what the no, fuck. No, if a blows come to me and they like hubba bubba, bro, come yeah, off, exactly. grow up. <laughs> You're 10. New information to me. What yeah. about like strawberry or something? What if they're like a fruit? No. You can you can enjoy one, but if you have to buy, if you're buying one and you're choosing strawberry, exactly. bro, grow up. 